Hi everyone, this is Erica with another playthrough of Dr. Path Traveler 2. I am heading back to the ant lion. Here I go. Smash. Oh, wow. Heck yeah. Nice. What to do? What to do? Nice. My journey will not end here. Okay. Hunt or be hunted. Right. Sacred flame guide you, or something like that. <laughs> How do I get there? Do be gentle. All the healing. I'll take this. There we go. Here I go. You sit <laughs>
Nice. If I go past where all the people are knocked out. Okay. All right. Do be gentle. Where was I? Here I go. Okay, nice. <laughs> Sounds great. Diffusing serum times one. Good, okay, one more battle, one more. So that she can gain a level two. Do be gentle. <laughs> to really do anything with that yet? Nah, I still have to gain a couple of levels. Okay. Okay. 
Okay. Oh dear. Okay. Okay, nice. Okay. out of it pretty soon. Let's do a bug eater. Oh, it's still out of it. Okay. Okay, summon the mayor. Nice. Here we go. Yeah. Nice. To work. strong though okay what to do what to do okay here we go okay very well Nice. Here I go. Okay. Very well. Need to be something again. Using Time for your medicine. Where was I? 
Nice. Hold it together. Poison slap. Nice. One more for a break. To work. Here I go. A pinch of this stellar work, Cassidy. Nice. Here we go. I should have used that one ability. Well, too late now. Okay. This is when I gotta start working faster. Let me summon the apothecary. Break them. Here we go. Okay, aggressive slash. There we go. You have healing hands. Where was I? Take that. Okay. Still out of it. On, okay, it's coming out of it now. Well, that didn't help, did it? Do, 
always in slide. Let's go. Let's go with the aggressive slash. What to do? What to do? Okay. Okay. Here I go. This will make it many. Okay, nice. Oh dear. Summon the mayor. Come, little lamb. Wow, smash, nice. Let's go. Jam. <clears throat> I hope it's learned its lesson. Looks like there's another path beyond there. The shaking stopped, and the sands seem to have stabilized. We should be able to focus on rescuing those still trapped. Which only leaves the little problem of war to deal with. Yeah. I know, right? <laughs> but yeah, it looks like there's a path beyond there. Wonder what's past there. Edmund. I never thought I'd see the day you'd save my life. <laughs> I had thought of outsiders only as threats. Locusts that devoured our food. Contributing nothing. But it appears that I was badly mistaken. He was mistaken too. So don't worry about it. I swear to you that when I return, I'll make a proposal to the king himself. I'll beg him to let us lay down our arms and welcome your people as our own. Seems I owe you an apology, and my thanks. <laughs> if it wasn't for a certain nosy do-gooder's nonsense, I would have never opened my eyes. <laughs> it's better to join hands as friends than raise arms as foes. I couldn't have said it better myself. I owe my life to your mercy and your valor. I won't soon forget it. You are one of Heir's apothecaries? Yes. I heard they were a gang of scoundrels who murdered the sick under their care. It seems those rumors were greatly exaggerated. We might have been. You saved the lives of me and my soldiers. On behalf of all of us here, I thank you. I only did what was right. I hear that you've misplaced your memories. Yes, but... A rumor reached my ears not long ago that may interest you. What sort of rumor? Hmm. It concerned heirs apothecaries. Heirs apothecaries. 
In other words, the association I was a part of. If I speak with him, it may jog loose some memories. Okay, one village area of his apothecary's visit saw its residents collapse and die in rapid succession. Those who fled the village and survived reported seeing purple rain pouring out of a strange cloud above the village. Purple rain? It's pretty freaky. But was that caused by the heirs' apothecaries or was somebody else doing that? Village. Wait. Rain. Purple rain? Purple rain. What causes purple rain? Who is this person? Dead. 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 The person seems to have gone mad. Rain! Storm! Keep on pouring! Do you understand what you're doing? Of course, Chief. I'm following our precepts to their logical end. So she's a chief. Extending a helping hand to all in need. Isn't that right? <laughs> so that's why he's, they got a, such a bad reputation. This rain brings salvation. on your face it seems you've remembered something if you'll excuse me I'll take my leave now goodbye apothecary <sighs> what was that horrendous rain was that robed figure? Yeah. I can't remember. Like an evil apothecary or something? Or apothecary gone mad? Something terrible happened in that place. I'm sure of it. Some awful tragedy. Yeah, definitely. And I need to remember. In a town of immigrants, Casty meets someone with knowledge of her past. Dark rumors swirl about heirs apothecaries, and Casty is haunted by disturbing images dredged up from deep within her. What lurks in the mists of her past? Casty must continue her journey to find out. See the Apothecary Chapter 2, Cyro. End. Cross Path, the Apothecary and Hunter Part 1 is available. Oh, the Apothecary and Hunter. Okay. Prayer to the Flame. Rise again. Okay, nice. Yeah, I don't want to do that. <laughs> Way too strong for me. Okay. 
Here we go. We can save here. How much money? Okay. Let's go to the cafe. Let's go... So how do I take the crossed path? Let's look here. Tutorial. Maybe it's evident on the world map. There, these are stories starring tr two travelers walking a singular path. Icon for these stories will appear on the map. Both travelers must be in your party for the story to begin. Okay. Cropdale. That will be my next destination. If I take the south path, path out of Psy and then go west and take the fork in the road north, should be able to get there. Alternatively, I could also focus on getting to Ryu. Only problem is there does not seem to be a way, a simple way there from where I'm going to be going. Now if I take Ken O'Brien head keep heading west, I could go here, but honestly, I'm kind of interested in the cross path here. So let me take the cross path. Wait. Yeah. If I take the south path out of I think I'm going the wrong way. Oh wait. Okay. Who are all these people? Merchant, healing grape. An old man who's been selling fruit here as long as any can remember. His supply line is a closely guarded secret. His fruit is always fresh and his prices are the lowest around. He has great sympathy for the young children. Living with an elderly couple and always make sure to give them a bit extra free of charge. Okay. One of a few children living with an elderly couple in town. She's quite mature for her age and helps the couple around the house without being asked. She's an accomplished haggler and cook and regularly puts together meals on a budget that would beggar belief for most chefs and bookkeepers. Okay. I was completely unaware of this part. So he's got the wild smash ability too. An apprentice carpenter brimming with vigor. He's courting the woman working at the tavern whose life circumstances forces her to toil without a day's respite. And wants to make journeyman as soon as he can be there for her properly. Well, let's give you some practice with your asks. Come, my wayward lad. If you're in need of help, I'd be happy to offer it. What is this? Statue looks kind of... The whole area looks kind of run down. That used to be the great kingdom of U, but it was destroyed dozens of years ago by Ku. I heard a lot of innocents were killed, but many managed to flee to the Harborlands. Okay, a townsperson researching the fallen nation of U, once the mightiest nation on the western continent. U was obliterated decades ago when the nation of Ku rose against it in war. However, traces of its advanced technology remain for the finding to this day the canals of Ken O'Brien are one example. Oh, so Ken O'Brien was, was part of it. Very helpful. Okay. Boy. One of the children taken in by the elderly couple in town. He has taken on the role of eldest son, wrangling the others and generally keeping them in line. Even the adults in town admire his leadership in that regard. He works diligently in order to repay the kindly couple that has so graciously taken him in. Thank you. Okay. 
order of two siblings living with an elderly couple in town. The war robbed them of their parents, and so they find themselves among the orphans in the couple's care. The shock and upheaval of it all has caused this young girl to close herself off from the world. She hardly speaks to anyone these days. Thank you. Okay, perfect. One of the children living with an elderly couple in town while his parents are off working in the eastern continent. Quite the gourmet. He is always eager to share food with the younger children as well. Thank you. Okay. Who's this lady? Or girl? Well, teenager. One of the children living with an elderly couple in town has the oldest child in the group. She often finds herself withdrawn to be by her lonesome when the remainder of the group gathers to play. She's beginning to think hard about the future and needs time alone to do so. That was very helpful. Okay. Energizing pomegranate. Carpenter. Carpenter is an apprentice who began practicing under his master under alongside a close childhood friend. He saw the woman working the tavern recently. It was love at first sight, and he hopes to profess his affections for her soon. It's well-meaning, if a bit clumsy. That was very helpful. Okay. Stop right there, stay out. It's dangerous. Yeah, I probably want to... Master of guilt that manages buildings in the worst East District. He, these days, he spends his time preventing the local children from entering the particularly dilapidated storehouses situated on the back streets. He wants nothing more than to tear them all down, but try as he might, he cannot secure the proper permissions. Okay, proper permissions from whom? Herb of revival. How I get in all these places? Oh, I see these stairs over there. Dragon Ridge. I probably do not want to go there. Woman who spends her days loitering in the town square. Her face betrays no emotion whatsoever. She's quite considerate. However, she hands out snacks to the children in the afternoon. Silently, of course. It's a mite creepy. Thank you. Okay. Glass marble. Okay. The younger two sons of the other couple in the town, blah blah that blah. Was very There we go. So 
go head west. Are you my next patient? Here I go. Is this the path I can take to the west? That's the chest. I think it's down. One down. So yeah, let's see. Sai Arbor Lens, Western Sai Sands. I think it's where I need to go. Poison that must be purged. Here we go. Such an extreme statement. Go on, then. Where was I? to the western sands. <sighs> I am wanting to move toward the north. Awakening. Okay, I'm gonna get that chest first. Yeah, this looks pretty. Iron shield.
Okay. To work. large I'm going to presume yeah this is that fork in the road okay Cleansing leaf. Eastern Wellgrove Trail. Leaflands. So I think we're in a new country now. Is that a town or temple to our west? Ooh, brand new enemies. Nope. What about this? Okay. Okay. What about this? Okay. Broke that. Okay, demon right deer. What to do? What to do? Right. <gasps> Ooh, what about this one? Feather storm. Oh, oh my God. Now let's grab the food. Nice. That'll give me some great flexibility. I'm just gonna have to just take in and enjoy the journey. Ooh, I see. Chest. Okay. Okay. Very well. Okay.
people stab. Oh wow. I'm hungry. Fool's leaf, I'm guessing it does confusion. What is that guy on the lower left? You know what I should uh, I should do this. Okay. Oh dear. Okay, now they can all be broken. Double thrust. Eh, perhaps not as much of a priority. Oh wow. What to do? What to do? Nice. I know no cure for evil. Forget me do. What is a forget me do? What does that do? Got a shadow based yeah. attack. To work. What does that do? There's somebody there. Life is too precious to risk. Oh dear. I think not. What to do? Right. Desert aim. I'm seeing a town over there on the left. Oh, there's somebody there. Okay. 
tank? Let's go. Now let's grab some food. Okay. What's your problem, huh? You looking for a fight? I still are about these here things fair and square. Touch them and I'll cut your hands off. Okay. Find out more. Time for some questioning. <laughs> to work. Okay, that doesn't work. A new beginning. Where was I? Take that. Okay. How could I fall? So it goes. Yeah, that guy might be a little too tough for me. Powering lychee. Okay, nice. Here we go. Come on, then. This. Okay. Right. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Ouch! Oh, couldn't capture him. Well, Grove, okay. So it looks like a town here. Sleepy town, perhaps. I don't think it has anything to do with, really with the story. Okay. Refined sword. Doom breaker. Plate buckler. Horned helm. I'll get that for him. Elemental robe. And I think that's good. What is this? It's not open. Hello. Soldier bow. Let's take a look at the world map. Okay, there's a road that goes out west. I probably don't want to take this route. Dancer's Guildmaster, I do not refuse those who come nor pursue those who leave. That's the rule of my class. Hermes was treated the same way. She came to my guidance, so I gave it. When I, she danced on her own two feet, she left the nest. I shall assist you. Yay! Alfric's blessing grant a single ally ability to act again at the end of this turn for three turns. Oh wow. Raises the elemental attack with single ally, win base damage. I like that. I like that. 
cause a curious effect to occur one time. <clears throat> Show goes on. Extends duration of augmenting effects. Enables the equipment character to more easily evade. Yeah, ever evasive. Yeah, let me get that dagger. It's not time a big building like this is completely empty. It has a shadow for herself expressing the look at it. Retired merchant who spends the day roaming the town and complaining that it isn't as prosperous as it used to be. He thinks of himself as inspiring others to better themselves. Brunel just thinks he's a bore. Thank you. Okay, nice. Double slash isn't too bad. Who do I have with me now? Mm. I don't know, I'm leaning toward that. Cafe. I and Papa don't get along very well these days, but I don't understand why. Is it because Papa isn't my real Papa? But I love them both so much. Maybe if we all get together, we can figure something out. So it begins the tale of Through a Child's Eyes. Okay. Brooding girl, age 10. A girl nursing her worries on the edge of the village after losing her father. At an early age, she now lives with her mother and much older stepfather. Okay. Thank you. We're gonna race here, but I've never seen Alron before. Rumor has it he hates being around people, so he spends all his day cooped up in the manor. Only daughter of the town apothecary, determined to father and her mother, to, determined to follow in her mother's footsteps since she was a young girl. She thought her mother would be happy about her decision to study in Montwise, but her mother urged her to reconsider her plan, which is, Thank which is you. given her pause. who deals in tapestries and rugs his wares are of the highest quality but he seems oddly unenthused about him in actuality he just has trouble concentrating on lack of inner innate charisma compounded by a gloomy face that runs in the family okay I wonder what it takes to get him out of his manor here Oh, yay! Wind Soulstone. What do I do? I do out of love for my family, but my wife refuses to listen to my reasons, like talking to a wall. Okay, wealthy older man who lives in Wellgrove. He lived a solitary life until a few years ago when he married a much younger woman with a child of her own. He now has a family for the first time, but feels self conscious about I'm his age. Okay. But my teacher might be her kindness abounds an office dancer with an elegant air she specializes in the traditional folk dances of Hinoeuma and speaks in a distinctly old-fashioned manner though still a trainee she seems to revive a bygone era in her performances and has already won many fans I remember that moves with her Dang it. Come, 
come. I... But I need to get information out of her first. Trinity dancer who excels at joyous, flamboyant dances in which her bright personality and unfailing good cheer can shine. Her talent may appear to be a gift, but it actually comes from hard, grueling practice. Her dazzling smile betrays no hint of the blood, sweat, and tears that went into it backstage. That was very helpful. Okay. Yeah. Come, my wayward lamb. This is awful. I slept on a well. Iris, you can't eat them. In fact, we slept on one of the iris filled with this horrible stink. I wish we could put them to use for something. Born and raised. Okay. Thank you. Hmm. That was very helpful. So it's it's hard to make good use of it. I have to say, but this town is on its last legs. Apothecary has practiced in town for many years. Her only daughter hopes to take over her business at some point, but when she looks back on her own life in which she was forced to put her patients over her own family, she finds it hard to support her daughter's plans, flattering as they may Thank be. path out of the city town here we go strengthening serum okay great all right i'm gonna wrap it up i can now warp here which is a great thing but i am going to continue on my path so i want to try that cross path And I'm getting powerful. Like, these enemies are starting to like buckle over for me. What is this place? Looks like an abandoned house.
Here we go. There we go. Now we got the chest. Refreshing jam. Whatever that does. Treasure chest there. Magus knife. Okay. Okay, lowers physical attack but greatly weakens elemental attack. gain another level. Northern Wellgrove Trail. It's raining. Okay. It's looking like if I want to go there, I need to go east from here. Seems to be some kind of cave or building where it terminates there. Take aim. Salt the wound. Incurs 50% chance of acting twice when breaking a foe. This will not trigger in succession. Okay, I like that. Replenish health. Preventative measures. Dolder's charity. In the reach of a single ally's items to affect all for three turns. Ooh, that sounds pretty nice. Uh, grants the equipment character immunity and feeling effects for three turns at the start of battle. Okay. Fendi's bow, divine skill, unleash a powerful bow attack on all foes three times. Oh, wow. That's definitely something to look forward to. Let's 
Southern Cropdale Trail, you know, you know a Uma. Okay, should break them all. Forget me, forget me not. But it seems to be the opposite. They want you to forget. Yeah. She only has 214 JP. What, you stop learning it a lot after a certain level or something? Okay. I like the rain. I always like rain. It's always so nice. someone there clearing the sound of a rain brings peace to my heart same here everlasting darkness right this way meeting in the rain is once in a lifetime dang it I should have gotten the information well I think I knew about that now. Okay, another treasure chest. Yeah, what a gorgeous place. Hunt or be hunted. Well now. What is that? Giant boar, okay? Okay, good. Seed is double stab. No, okay. To work. Oh, I should have used bow instead. No, okay. Bide. Okay. 
Now let's grab some food. Yeah, salt the wound. Nice. Magic eater. Slim chance to reduce target's elemental attack. Not quite as powerful, but I actually like it. Okay, pretty. Oh, oh, I'm going to turn around. Sacred flame guide you, or something like that. Yeah, that dagger dance, dang, that is powerful. Even without him being broken, that's still a lot of damage. Take this. What does that sign say? Merlane Southern Crocodile Trail. Oh, ooh, you got people hanging out. It's raining. So who are you people? Just aid it. <laughs> Very well. Okay. So sorry to work. Nope. Okay. In that case ruinous kick. That's how it's done. Oh dear. That's how it's done. Nice. Information acquired. 
required. Ha. Young man who serves the night as a squire, he is all but emotionless, his face remains unchanged. And when following the night, he serves into battle. On rainy days, however, a strange vulnerability appears in his eyes and he gazes at the sky as if the past were in there to be ran. Red. Oh, okay. I can talk to her. Good grief, I'm in a rush, but this train rain just won't let up. Polar ice? Let's try it, I guess. <laughs> Where was I? Okay. As long as I can survive, I can get this. Knight who ducked in to escape a sudden shower. She knew that rain was coming in this area, but decided to pass through anyway as a necessary shortcut to repeat. She had no choice but to come this way and certainly did not do so for the sake of her squire who loves the rain. Okay. Very insistent explanation. Okay, Southern Cropdale Trail. Oh, danger level is actually less here. shot. <laughs> Festival Garland. Who increases your max SP is its main attraction. You are a poison that must be purged. Here I go. Open your eyes. Right. Okay. Come on, Where was I? Okay, not weak to that. So sorry. Here I go. What about this? Okay. Eastern Cropdale Trail, Ors Rush. Warburg Trail, where's Ors Rush? First, let me see. The hunt is on. What to do? What to do? Let's go. Okay. this place. Is it some kind of camp? Are you my next patient? Oh dear. I'm trying to investigate here, people. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. 
Head or is fresh. Zoom Orzresh is a town. Oh, it's a completely different region. Okay. Okay, so that's where you recruit. Um, what's his face? Perticio. First, I'm going to go this way. I'm going to do. <clears throat> that crossed path. I suggest you get out of my way. Let's go. Okay, let's see. There's probably going to be a chest somewhere, right? I suggest you get out of my way. Well, now. Healing grape M. Ready to be prey? Okay. All right. Let's head up here. I poison that must be purged. Well now. Okay, this should be we should be getting near to Cropdale. make sure where exactly I should be going based on the world map. Let's see. Oh, I should be heading west. If I go east, I'll be coming up toward this area. Crack Ridge. Yeah, and that continues his story. And I can go there afterward, but for now... I'm going to make my way to Cropdale, then north of Cropdale looks like there is some more isolated paths that you can only go to via that town. Okay. Huh. Is that like a town there? But of course you have to brave that trail. So I am going to head west. <laughs> okay, here we go. Hunt or be hunted. My prey awaits. Okay. Nice. Here I go. Okay. Weak enemies. Domination. Ground shield. I'm gonna guess that's the path that's gonna take me to the east. Are you my next patient? Here I go.
Yeah. Cropdale Wildlands. Southern Cropdale Trail. So yeah, we're starting to get into town. Slumber Sage. Okay, let's go. Cropdale. That's right, I had business here. Apothecary and the Hunter, part one. Cassie and Ochid arrive in the lively little village of Cropdale. The beastling catches a whiff of something delicious, so the two follow her nose to a merchant stall. Okay. Yeah, let's do this tale. All right, and I'm going to go ahead and close it off for now. Whoa. As soon as I... Wow. A lot of people here. <laughs> it is a lively little village. They say it's famous for peaches and raspberry pie. Uh, fruit? Yeah, I'll stick with meat. A purely carnivorous diet isn't good for you. Everything in balance, all in moderation. Yes, Dee! You sound like my mother. <laughs> hey, something smells good! Oh, looks like meat there. Welcome, travelers. Meat vendor. Care to try Cropdale's new delicacy? Door door on a stick. Oh, yes, meat, real meat. <laughs> uh, oh shit, manners. May we have one skewer, please? Enjoy. Too much, oh chat. Ugh, this is gross. Ooh. Uh, excuse me. This meat tastes weird. Sorry about that. Not much I can do when it gets that old. Why don't you give us that old it's one then? Old garden of herbs just to cover the smell. Why you do you go jip. to such lengths to Whoa. old meat edible? That's not politically correct. Hunting's been bad lately. We can't get anything fresher. I've hunted these parts for years, but I've never seen it like this. Huh. Maybe we'll go take a look at the forest while we're here. Oh, you're a hunter too, Missy. That'd be a big help. The forest just past the village. Good luck. You'll need it. Okay. <laughs> Leave it to me. You mustn't overextend yourself, Ochet. <sighs> yes, Ma. <laughs> Purse of hope. to them you dropped your purse what would have happened if this calm stranger hadn't picked it up <laughs> very southern I I don't know Ugh, you can be so careless sometimes Agni say you're a traveler aren't you think you could take my sister with you but what she may act like a right fool sometimes, but she can do anything she sets her mind to. Okay. It'll put my mind at ease knowing she's not alone out there. 
so thank you kindly. But, hey, Paula! Kicking her out of the house. Well, now. My name's Agnia. I'm a dancer on a journey to become a star. And, um, now that I think about it, I never got to thank you for earlier. This must be fate. Would it be alright for me to join your travels? Sure. Thank you so much. Not right now. Okay. I'm a great dancer. You won't regret this. Dancer skills. She can use the following special commands: allure, entreat, dance session. All together now. Okay. 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 Practitioner and scholar of the art of weaving who travels far and wide to learn about different techniques and traditions. Old fashioned artisans do not reveal their secrets easily, so her research feels like pulling teeth at times. That was very helpful. Okay, great. I see a treasure chest. Okay, alright, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish up here and I will see you guys next time. Bye!